Hello everyone, my name is Slavi. Today I would like to share with you my second day of Fibonacci fasting. And uh, after re uh, writing this blog on the website, I would like to read it to everyone who is watching the YouTube channel. Day two, first cycle of the Fibonacci fasting, breaking the water fast. Um, at the beginning of the second day of the first cycle of the Fibonacci fasting, I weighed myself uh, around 7.30 p.m. and uh, I was weighing at around 148 pounds. Um, I recorded uh, that I consumed approximately uh, 1,500 calories, with, which might be a little lower uh, on the 15th. I slept approximately nine hours um, that day between the 14th and the 15th. Um, when I woke up, my blood pressure was at 137 to 78 millimeters of mercury. Um, on the 15th, I consumed approximately one liters of water uh, and my mood was continuing to be uh, still unhappy. And uh, I guess I was still curious, but uh, I was uh, more coming around to realizing that uh, I definitely need to take more days uh, not eating or consuming any calories. This is a mistake. I did not walk on the beach that night. I actually came home from the hike and I was quite exhausted. I was continuing to do my studying, which is doing research on the web. Um, on the 16th, after uh, sleeping, I weighed myself. I was weighing at around 147 pounds. I consumed much less than 1,900 uh, calories. This is probably a mistake. And I did sleep uh, nine hours between 15th and 16th of May. My blood pressure was much lower on the 16th than on the 15th of May. I also consumed approximately one liter of uh, filtered uh, water. Uh, my attitude was much better on the 16th uh, after waking up after the hike, um, and there was not many activities that I did on the 16th uh, day of May. Um, I did do my, my uh, daily research on the web. Uh, let me get more into the details um, of the ent uh, entry I made into the blog. Hello, my name is Slavi. I'm using the Fibonacci fasting in order to switch my life from making poor dietary, mental, and physical choices to choosing a healthier lifestyle. I would like to share my personal experience while using this fasting technique and record some data to compare to future results. On the second day of first cycle, I began with weighing myself, taking blood pressure, recording my sleep, making the uh, marking the time and date, recording the amount of water I consumed, and the things I felt during my fast and break. Day two. The fasting has begun on the night of May 15th at 7.30 p.m. till May 16th at 7.30 p.m. That night, I began my fast with drinking uh, a serving of liquid electrolytes. After 30 minutes, I cooked myself two fistfuls of Navy Mac, which is uh, this uh, European style of macaroni with uh, fried ground beef. One fistful of roasted nuts, one serving of mixed salad, one small silver dollar fried chicken. I continued my night by reading and doing my daily research on the computer. Right before sleep, I consumed approximately 500 milliliters of filtered water. Upon waking up, I performed my usual routines like three to six minutes of breath work or meditation, calisthenics, stretching or push-ups, 
and of course evacuation of bowels and uh, a medium warm shower. Also, I usually uh, in the morning prepare for ingestion of food. However, I was interrupted by a friend who invited me to go on a six hour hike in a very nice forest. While walking through the forest, I was able to drink approximately uh, one and a half liters of fresh uh, uh, filtered water that I took with me. Uh, and uh, I believe I ate a fistful of raw pine nuts. I ate a f uh, several slices of uh, dried mango. And uh, I believe I ate one whole complete cookie and two pears. During that day, my mood uh, was quite amazing and uh, optimistic, and I was pretty happy. I did not experience any frustration or mental uh, disbalance. On the way back home, um, I was able to consume a cheeseburger and a serving of fries, which was adding up to approximately 1,000 calories. In addition, I drank a cup of soda. Yes, that's quite un uh, unhealthy maybe, but uh, this is what I did. And uh, I would like to actually record my honest experience instead of hiding things uh, that um, the viewers or the listeners might not agree with. Um, okay, and basically I ended that day when I came home from the hike with a uh, fistful of nuts and a serving of liquid electrolytes. By the way, I, g I got those electrolytes uh, from uh, a local pharmacy. I believe you can find that in the um, um, treatment of stomach problems section. And um, it usually comes in a large bot bottle with three servings. Um, and uh, it tastes pretty good. And it does have uh, uh, a sufficient amount of... Um, elements that I want like to consume before uh, beginning or ending my fast. Okay, I guess this concludes my daily recordings for the second day of the Fibonacci fasting. Please stay tuned for the next day of my water fasting experience. Also, please visit our website, FibonacciFast.com, to read our blog or like to share and subscribe to the Fibonacci YouTube channel i'm sorry fibonacci fasting youtube channel so th that you can get in touch um and see what is happening with my body over time thank you for staying tuned and i will see you in the next video have an amazing day bye bye